Independent Electoral and Boundaries Commission is set to roll out a second and final enhanced continuous voter registration targeting over 4 million adult Kenyans. IEBC Chairman Wafula Chebukati says the commission is putting in place means to ensure a credible electoral process. Sam Kituku looks at key timelines to the August general election. It's now 220 days to the August 2022 general election. For IABC, theirs is a task to clear all hurdles to a credible election. To start them off, the Commission plans to roll out a nationwide vote registration to net more than 4 million adult Kenyans who didn't enlist as voters in October last year. At the time, IABC had a target of 6 million new voters, but only netted 1.5 million new voters. IABC Chair Wafula Chebukati says that the Commission is on course in planning and putting in place measures and mechanisms to ensure a simple, accurate, verifiable, secure, impartial, credible and transparent general election. IABC awarded the elections technology tender to Smartmatics Technologies, a Netherlands-based company, by the end of 2021, the Public Procurement Administrative Board ordered IABC to reconsider the ballot paper's tender that had been offered to Greek firm Inform Lycos SA Holdings. Reports indicate that the contract has since been signed. And as the road to the general election picks pace, public officers who intend to run for office have just over one month to hand in their resignation. By 9th of February, they must have left their offices to go seek election. On the 9th of April, political parties are expected to submit membership lists to the IEBC. This will be the same members who will participate in party primaries scheduled for 16th to 22nd of April. By the 9th of May, candidates who wish to contest as independents must have resigned from their political parties. Presidential hopefuls who will have been cleared by their parties or running as independent candidates will be processed and cleared by IEBC between 30th May and 10th of June. Other candidates for the seats of governorship, National Assembly, Senate, women representatives and county assemblies will be cleared by IABC at various offices across the country between 30th of May and 10th of June. But before all this happens, IABC is expected to publish a notice of general election on the 14th of March, marking the start of the election period during which the election code of conduct will be applied against contestants. The election will be on the 9th of August, with official election campaigns set for between 30th of May and 6th of August. The Commission is expected to declare the presidential election results by the 15th of August. By law, IBC has up to seven days to do so. In the meantime, Parliament is yet to conclude on the political party's amendment bill, which could have an impact on the conduct of the polls. The National Assembly is set to consider the bill next week in a three-day special sitting. Parliament is also expected to consider amendments to other election laws, including the Elections Act, which again could have an impact on IABC preparations. Sam Gitukusrezen TV, Nairobi.